Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to the latest video on the Scan Tool Network. In this video, we're going to do a quick demonstration of the iCarsoft CR Max on a BMW Mini Countryman. It's a 2020 model. Um, but obviously the tool does work on a lot of other makes and models as well. So we have the check engine light showing on the dashboard here. Now, um, I'm going to put the link to this kit in the description below this video. There are fakes, there are clones on the market, unfortunately, that can cause damage to your vehicle. So I'd highly recommend, if you are interested in going for this tool, use the links in the description and it will take you to the genuine product. So uh, we have the tool plugged into the diagnostic port here and we're going to click on to diagnostics. And we're going to select our manufacturer, which is Mini. So we'll just need to search for for mini here it is and it should generally be quite a quick process uh, to read the fault codes relating to the check engine light so we'll go to uh, go to VIN identity and you can click on read it'll automatically read the VIN code if you click OK to that it's t there's a message here that says vehicle unidentified do you wish to continue I've noticed it does that on every vehicle so don't worry about it, it has identified the vehicle and then what we'll do is we'll go to control units. So this is gonna uh, basically do us a quick test on a specific system within the vehicle. So we're looking for the engine. Uh, it doesn't always make it obvious, but in this one here, DME, Digital Motor Electronics, is the engine. So we're gonna click onto that, and we're gonna click read fault code. So freezing data are being read, and it's fault code 102613. That's a manufacturer specific fault code. Um, it's telling us that the hot film air mass meter short signal circuit short B plus fault currently triggers a driver information malfunction lamp. So it's telling us basically there was a problem with the mass airflow sensor or the MAF as it's also known. So we put a new mass airflow sensor in, that's why it's telling us fault not currently present because we put a new MAF in, um, the fault's no longer there but we've still got the check engine light on screen. So in order to get rid of the check engine light, we need to come out and we need to go to clear fault memory. So we do that and it's turned the check engine light off there straight away. So the iCarsoft uh, CR Max now has erase operation done and we'll just click OK and that was a really, really simple and easy process. And that's characteristic of the iCarsoft CR Max. It's a very easy uh, kit to use. It's, it covers a huge range of manufacturers and systems within these manufacturers as well. Um, so We've, got, we've done more detailed videos on this as well, um, but it might be worth checking those out if you are interested as well. So it does lots of service um, adaptions and uh, functions as well. So as I say, I'm going to put the link to this kit, the genuine product, in the description below this video. If you are wanting a genuine product, then make sure you use these links here. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.